I'm, I'm still muted, muted, but, but yeah, this is quote unquote new game. Mo modification for Portal 2. Wonder where we are going, and who we are playing. Actually, that's a good question. I, am I going to pay Chell or something? Some, somebody else. This looks like a human rated. Good morning, test subject. You have been in suspension for 72 days. Ah. The Aperture Science Computer Aided Enrichment Center congratulates you on your 36 year sleep anniversary. You what? have been selected as a potential candidate for our Human Emergency Response Team. Please review the agreement provided on the nearby monitor. Okay, I'm a girl. Nearby moni monitor. Accepted into the human emergency response team, you will now participate in an advanced difficulty testing track where your problem solving skills, athleticism, and response to increasingly hazardous conditions will be evaluated. Okay. Please press the button to accept the terms. <laughs> Thank you for volunteering. Yeah. The door will open in three, two, one. So 33, 36 years. In a freezer or something. This subject. Oh, this looks a bit bit run down. Isn't that glass? Somebody has broken the glass. Okay. Please remain calm. Test subjects may experience symptoms of mental defects after long-term chemically induced hibernation. Thank you for Informing. In a brain damage evaluation survey to determine just how damaged your brain is. If you believe your brain is sufficiently operational, press the button in front of you and continue the test. Very good. Please walk through the portal and continue testing. Your self-reported status is more than sufficient for testing. <laughs> Can can pe press buttons. Uh, companion cube. So what is human emergency response team? cube right yeah that's what I thought if I had a portal gun but I don't have a portal gun but I can I can stand on another what a cube is in in uh, holding the door open okay that's not Let's do this old old fashioned way. Please be a 
advised that noticeable damage to eyesight is not part of any test protocols, but is an unintended side effect of the Aperture Science Material Emancipation Grill, which in semi-rare cases may emancipate some of the light-sensing rods and cones inside your head. Okay. Can't can jump over there, but I can go here and get the get the portal gun. You are now in possession of the Aperture Science handheld portal device. As a candidate for the Human Emergency Response Team, you are expected to adapt to all dangerous situations, and as such, will not be informed about the device's safety hazards. <laughs> okay, good thing I. Maybe. Good. Maybe. So human emergency response team. What are we supposed to do? What What is the emergency? I love how this the is actually voice over. The time to measure puzzle solving and execution speed during extreme wind and weather conditions. In the rare case that wind and weather conditions appear to be ordinary, please stay idle in the entrance foyer until the desired conditions are met. Okay, that kills. Yeah, they destroys the cubes. And blocks portals, apparently. Okay, I can go through it. Okay. So where's the okay here here's the here's the cube. Okay, I, I can change only the position of one one portal. We are going to take this to here. As start starting and easy. Stop. Congratulations, test subject number one. You have set the world record for this exercise, and now officially hold first and last place on the leaderboard. That was my question. That I'm a, I'm a only only test subject. Okay, what do we have here? The 
next test may contain concentrated amounts of electromagnetic radiation that may be harmful to the retinas of some humans. The Enrichment Center recommends to solve this test with closed eyes, as health insurance will not be provided for this specific exercise. In case the light-sensing rods and cones of your eyes have previously been emancipated by an emancipation grill, feel free to ignore the prior warning. So what, what's this? Uh, it's a beam, beam splitter or something. Now, how, how do we... ...gauge the laser? Ah, uh, we need a um, beam splitter here. Anything, anything here? That doesn't look good. Now it's working, I can pass here, but it's going to shut down the portal, which means I need to do the por por portal again. And now it's open, okay. So we just jump over the laser and... <laughs> okay, this was easier than I thought. You have or completed the test. If you have not done so already, you are permitted to open your eyes. Making test with without opening eyes, okay. Completing it. Okay, interesting. I I wonder how, how difficult these tests are going to be. Before starting with the next test chamber, we would like to remind you that, so far, no experiment has yet unproven whether or not weighted storage cubes are not incapable of not feeling pain when being emancipated. Good to know. Okay, we can still make, make one, just one portal. The portal is here. Can we jump? No. No, yeah. Last panel I can't 
can't shoot through it. There's uh, some kind of weird window here. And this is going to open the window shutters, I think. Okay, sure. And it's opening the door. Can we get more? Accidental genius. Okay, beam splitter. beams well done candidate you mm -hmm. have successfully solved five test chambers to ensure a high quality of human resources the following test chambers may include elements of danger extra caution is advised good luck hit that doesn't look good okay Delicious. So wait, th there's a button which I need to press, and it's going to drop the. Under, under them. Because when that drops, it has some speed. If I can make a portal here, no, I don't. Uh, it could get some speed enough to fly over there. Yeah, that sounds like a plan, but how how I'm going to do it? There's not a single place I can actually go and push push the button. Ah, uh, I need to beat the human cannonball. Oh no, oh no. This is so bad idea. Whee! Gravity can't hold me. Oh, okay. I knew it. It's making sounds. On behalf of the Enrichment Center, I wish to apologize about the current state of our testing facility. Due to technical difficulties, we are unable to provide an experience of suitable quality at this time. Oh. Okay, it's removing the shield here. Or oh, emancipation field. Whatever.
I have two pieces. I might, might as well use them. Don't see it, sleep. They can do your your job. Up at the laboratories. Let's explore a bit. We got to see behind the scenes in a, in a basic basic uh, portal too, but didn't didn't understand the purpose of the apparatus science lab. If 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 this had any purpose. Other than they had like been doing it like from 1950s tests for some reason. As a consequence of semi-recent events, some aerial faith blades could be misconfigured and launch objects into arbitrary directions. Be careful. Okay. Good to know, maybe. Okay. Well, that's definitely wrong. Give me a second. <laughs> We're on direction. There. Try that. Good. That faith plate is now proper. So that's why there are holes in the ceiling. <laughs> okay. This is uh not fun. <laughs> Fine. Uh Okay. Okay, I died. Jump this with with the uh, box in my hand or oh, cube. No. Let's try it. Okay, that was proper ca calibration. Okay. Okay, what's that? 
that requires something. Yeah, that's around. I think this is a round cube or something. <laughs> okay. Well done. From now <laughs> on, all aerial faith plates should be configured correctly. I promise. Uh-huh. Test chamber. Uh -huh. This last chamber and completing the testing track will grant you membership into the Aperture Science Human Emergency Response Team. Okay. Laser goes there. Something there. Okay, we have two do uh, two buttons that we need to activate in order to get the pass. And that's the elevator that activates. Correct solution. I can turn it off by not not having a portal or having a portal. This needs to be energized. And that's on only like elevator. is safe. Although many of the aperture scientists science experiments are not really safe. Let's 
back back here. And now I need to energize this. So only only way is to get the portal. Portal to like laser through the portal. And for that I need another beam splitter. And that kind of destroys the old one. Yep. Let's not burn ourselves with the with the laser. Okay, but uh, what happened? Okay. Interesting lag spike. As a reminder. Your Aperture Science provided health insurance does not cover injury or fatality from immolation from the Aperture Science Hard Light Bridge. Rest assured that unlike your fragile human tissue, all Aperture Science equipment has been built to withstand temperatures of up to 4,000 degrees Kelvin. Why? Why? <laughs> Here it's going to destroy my portal, yes. And I need to need to repeat same mistakes. So first this is here. Then it's going to move there. Okay now and now we have a Bridge out over troubled waters. I'm going to go here, jump over there, <laughs> and yep. Order a new. Now have one free portal. This one free portal is going going to bring bring this bridge. I'm going to back here. I'm going to jump to the funny thing here. I'm going to take this cube here. Bring it here. Use the bridge and get through the level. Yeah, sometimes this feels like <laughs> the whole game makes me feel that I'm I'm stupid. <laughs> okay, ouch. Congratulations! You did it! Hello. Sorry for the surprise. Current testing protocol demands I dispose of all test subjects, so I had to intervene before you were uh baked. I'll be honest with you now. There is no Aperture Science Human Emergency Response Team. I made it up. Sorry for lying to you. Before I can explain why I brought you here, we need to get you registered as an Aperture employee. 
We don't want security systems to hunt you down after all. The Guardian and Intrusion System doesn't like it when test subjects escape the chambers. There's a security checkpoint nearby. Follow me.